really well. Stick to the routine, I'll be safe. I'll like, always be here. Stay in our rooms, I'll be safe. As long as I don't go outside, I'll be safe. That's it. Good boy. <coughs> what time is it? We need time, Mum. Yes.
mum said I have to keep my vitamin B levels up. I wonder if my radiation level is safe. Radiation is just over 70 MR. That's acceptable. Bunker radiation is normal. Good. What delights do we have today? Peaches. My favourite. So that makes 27 years, three months and 14 days of food left. drawing I did for Mum. What shall I read to Mum? We had a dreary morning's work before us, but there were no sign of any wind, and the boats had gone out and manned and the ship wrapped three or four miles around the corner of the island and up around the narrow passages to the haven behind Skeleton Island. I volunteered for one of the boats where I had.
Radiation is nearly ATMR. It's increasing. Twenty-seven years, three months, and thirteen days left. We had a dreary morning's work before us, for there were no sign of any wind, and the boats had gone out and manned and the ship wrapped three or four miles around the corner of the island and up around the narrow passages to the haven behind Skeleton Island. I volunteered for one of the boats where I had. Radiation is over 80 MR. Where's the manual? I don't know what to do. If I find the manual, I can fix this. My old diary. Today it is my birthday and I have had extra peaches, my favourite, and there was a candle. Mum gave me this book and some pens. Look, here are the colours. Vera sang me a ring a ring of roses. She said she was crying because she is happy, it's my birthday. And then she and PJ and Louie and Mum sang me happy birthday, but not too loud. I blew out the candle. This book is going to be my book about my friends. Today I will start a new friend. He will look like this. He will be a soldier because I have a general, but I need a bigger army. I've got a block from the map room, but I had to hide. Mr. Bishop was there. He nearly saw me. He was shouting. He says I am a waste. I think he is a waste. I will make the soldier and Mr. Churchill and Joan of Arc will tell him to fight Mr. Bishop.
We had ham today. It is sort of pink and sticky. It is better than sardines, which are the worst. Mum has made my knife sharper so I can finish off doing my soldier. She says Rocky was the best at winning fights, so that's his name. I finished Rocky, so here are all my friends. I don't need new underwear right now. The manual. Find the fuse box level two. Find the fuse box level two. Mum. I need to find the fuse box on level two. Don't need to change. I'm not sure I can do this. Find the key. I need to fix the fuse. My old drawings.
And I've taken the spoil supplies off and, and spit it out. Up. 14 months at best. If we carry on as we are, eight months. But I, I've gone over it with Dr. Hart. On bare minimum, we might make 14. And bare minimum means? I didn't like to press him, but scurvy, rickets. Christ. Ben. Then we all just withered away to skin and bone. <sighs> Maybe I should have just left the hatch open and gone for a nice stroll in the fresh air instead. What do we do? We tell people everything's all right. It's not all right. One it. whiff of this and you'll have your throat slit over the last tin of peaches. Is that the way you want to die, Sam? Fighting over scraps? We could just cut your wrist now and the rest of us will split your rations. Chin up, man. It's ten minutes until the next bulletin. The Communication from Bunker HQ, Site 3, Corsham, Wiltshire. Prime Minister delivered safely before blast hits. 4,013 government ministers and civil servants, including cabinet office, local and national government agencies, intelligence and security advisors logged in. Shortage noted in domestic support staff. Guess they didn't make it. 
All facilities operating normally. Checks carried out in infirmary, bakery, laundry, kitchens, telephone exchange, storerooms, office space, living accommodation, maintenance areas and workshops. How big is that place? Trust me, you get sent to this sardine tin. Prime Minister unsatisfied with living accommodation. Twat. Other. Civilian casualties noted outside bunker. A group of 50 attempted to breach rear exit blast door. Aggressive action not required. Activity ceased after blast. Poor bastards. AB welcomes. CB asks clarification purpose of meeting. AB puts forward petition from 18 residents keen to institute post of morale officer. It is felt that CB is not forthcoming enough in communicating current status of bunker to residents. CB makes point that any urgent change in status will be communicated very clearly to all residents when it becomes relevant. In his view, no need for a new position. AB cites two safety incidents and asks the committee if they were aware. All but FH, DM, SC are unaware of said incidents. CB says neither incident is cause for immediate concern. No need to raise panic in difficult atmosphere. Calls on FH to clarify incidents. FH agrees not of immediate concern. AB raises point that lack of trust in bunker hierarchy is causing morale issues. More clarity and openness needed. CB reiterates appointed hierarchy and his belief that no need for additional officer. If any critical incident comes to light, all will be made aware. Requests end to meeting as urgent business to attend to. AB calls for vote on appointment of morale officer. CB says vote will be ignored. Not a democracy. Meeting ended. Say, for example, the hit on Reading was one megaton. That would mean we have this radius, only halfway to Basingstoke. Now, maybe that looks small, but that's around 100,000 fatalities, maybe 80,000 injuries from the blast and the fireball. That's just to start with. Prevailing wind direction here is northeast. Fallout scatter would be huge. It's likely to drift all the way out past Cambridge. 
past Norwich even, out to sea. The total number of casualties? Unimaginable. And that's one bomb. With the greatest respect, sir, we've been up all night. It's been 10 minutes since I had to cover Vera's face. But and is it radiation I don't sickness? know yet. The nearest proper lab is under 10 tons of radioactive rubble, and I have to make do with a microscope. It's all right, George. <sighs> we'll run some tests, Mr. Bishop. Is anyone else showing signs? Yes, six others. Quarantine them right away. Find out where they were working, what they've had contact with, and what they've been eating. We need a source. Margaret. It's all right. Come here, love. What's the matter? I can't sleep. It's all right. You know if you stay in your room, you'll be safe. Let me put a tick. I don't like it here. Testing, one, two, three. Testing, one, two, three. Attention, the mains power is about to be switched off for maintenance purposes. I don't like it here. I don't like it here. There's nothing I need here.
that's the damaged one. Here's the replacement. Please be okay, please be okay. No, no, no. Suit. I don't have an NBC suit. I need an NBC suit before I can go to level 4.
I don't like it here. I don't like it here. The NBC suit is gone. Commissioner. The war room. Soldier. right at the front with the tanks. So out with it. What couldn't you tell me yesterday? There's no hope for any of them. I... I don't know. It's not radiation poisoning. The water's clean, the air is clean. It's not the food. And yet the symptoms... Can't shake the feeling that someone is up to something. Damn it, George. We don't have time for your fantasies. You need to figure this out with facts. We don't know where this thing comes from or how it will spread. We have no cause. We have no cure. We just don't have the resources to deal with it. There is no help. There is no cavalry. There's just us. So get yourself together and fix this. Do you understand me? What's that? Cooling system. <sighs> I'm sorry, Mr. Bishop. I'm, I'm just on edge. This place, it's full of ghosts.
What we don't know for certain is the contamination levels. We can calculate the likely fallout and its effects, but we don't have any good model for anthrax spore spread, or even how it's affected by radiation. Look, we do know from reports at AE3 in Oxford that anthrax was used in wave three. We've just got no idea of the extent of it. It's not as if we can go up and test anything. We can't even count the bodies. This door only opens in an emergency.